What's up guys, Kobe here, and it's a really hot and boring say, d d sorry, it's a really hot and boring day, so I figured I, sh I just want to make a pocket knife video on my pocket knife collection, so yeah, I know I already made one, but that was a little while ago when I only had a few knives, now I got a little bit more, so uh, yeah, okay, let's get started, alright, this one I showed in my first video. So, like I said, it's got the, the gold, the gold spots, wooden, great, great first knife. It's not that sharp, but it's still good. And it's got the, um, the thing on the back that you close it with. And my grandpa gave me this case. So, uh, yeah. Okay. Next one is this Swiss Army knife. Um, it's got two blades on it, red Swiss Army knife. Let me try and get this out. So yeah, it's got the one blade right here. It's pretty sharp. And the other blade, smaller blade. Pain in the butt to get out though. Alright, whatever, we'll just leave it in there. Okay. And it's got the case. As you saw. Get it in there. Okay. Next we'll do this little mini knife. Got a blade on it, nail file cleaner thing and a pair of scissors. It's got a little keychain hook thing so you could put it on like your keys or something. So that's pretty cool. Okay, next this one. I got this one from the dollar store, which is actually a really good deal because it's not that bad of a knife. It's got scissors, bottle opener, corkscrew thing, you know, nail file nail cleaner thing. It's got a screw thing. A, oh my god, I'm drawing a blank. A blank. A screwdriver, yeah. And another small blade and scissors and all that stuff. So this one is kind of like another one I have. This one my grandpa gave me. Most of these, most of my new ones are from my grandpa. So this one is kind of basically the same thing, except this one is smaller, and it's got basically the exact same thing on it, except like a different design and it's smaller. It's got the pocket knife, the scissors, the small blade, um, screwdriver, bottle cork opener thing, nail file, nail cleaner thing. So yeah. Alright, next is this knife, which my grandpa also gave me. I don't really like this one that much because it's a pain in the butt to get out, and the blade is really weird. It's a weird shape and a terrible grip. So, I can't get this out, so, yeah. Alright, this one. This is actually in my favorites. I like this one. It's all, it's all gray and steel and stuff. I don't know if you can see the brand name. Yeah, there's a brand name. It's got a thing on the back to close it, which is a pain in the butt. Your fingers. Okay, so next, this blade which I already showed you in my first video. It's got the, got this at a flea market for like eight bucks, I think. It's got the thumb cap thing and thing inside that you close it with. So, yeah. Okay. All right, next, this is a utility knife, which I got off of Amazon for 20 bucks. It's got the knife. This knife is actually really sharp, though. It's 
so it's really heavy and thick, but it's definitely a good thing. It's got a saw on it, a fish skinner and picker upper thing, whatever you want to call that. Uh, screwdriver, whoa, no screwdriver, mini knife, bottle cap opener thing, can opener, scissors, all that kind of stuff. Uh, last but not least, this is a huge one. This was my great grandmother's, I think, and my grandpa gave this to me because he gave me like most of the pocket knives I have. So yeah, it's pretty huge. Let's see if I can take it out. My hands are really slippery. I just can't get it out. I'm gonna dry my hands off. Okay. Okay, so there it is. Got the brand name right there. This was made in France. And it's got the gold thing and the marble and this thing and a nice design on the side. So, yeah. Oh, and it's got the ridges up here. Okay, so that is about it. And thank you guys for watching this video. And I will see you guys soon. Um, have a good day. Bye.